Techtopia completely revamps villages and how its residents operate. From reworked villager AI to an expanded profession roster, villagers come to life as villagers perform their own duties throughout the day. As for the player, they have the ability to influence the growth and economy of the village, creating dynamic and thriving communities. It's been a while since this mod has been looked at, and although the mod hasn't received any further developments, there's a small range of add-ons to revitalize a Techtopia experience. So get prepared for building a new Techtopia village, as we list most of the Techtopia add-ons available to enhance playing with the mod. Overseeing a Tectopian village involves many responsibilities, and over time, it could pose its own set of challenges. One such add-on, Tectopia Information, is a useful mod to assist in seeing a village's details. Through a book, players have the ability to view information about a Tectopia settlement from interacting on structure markers, beds, or villages. The Tectopia book highlights a simple and thorough overview of the village, detailing its inhabitants and the occupations to logging any passing visitors or enemies, as well as outlining its buildings, geography and economy. Whether it's checking on the village's size or determining the satisfaction of its residents, Tectopia information brings a quick and handy process to better manage a Tectopia village. Villagers in Tectopia receive a few sorts of visitors, bringing an element of surprise to the day or night. The next few mod add-ons build upon that system with new passing visitors to be on the lookout for. Merchants are one type of vendor that can increase trade for a village, and one mod add-on, the Tectopia Trader, provides another vendor to make deals with. Traders will usually reside at the market stalls, where players can trade their uncommon minerals, metals and gems for emeralds. As the village population grows, traders will make less visits. Depending on how far the player has progressed in their world, the trader villager can provide a quicker method to acquiring emeralds easier. The next mod add-on, Tectopia Tinker, also includes a new wandering merchant to encounter. Situated at the blacksmith or at the market stall, Tinkers can make tokens from other villages compatible with the current village, ensuring those tokens get put to good use. However, more populated villages will incur fewer visits from Tinkers, so be sure to make some good deals when they're available. Regardless, players who want only to develop one Tectopia village may have the added incentive to revisit other villages to acquire any extra tokens or markers. Eventually, there may come a point where markers and tokens are no longer desired. Thankfully, there's one particular vendor, the Tectopia Recycler, that can put them to use. Recyclers too station themselves by a blacksmith or a market stall, where players are able to trade in their structure markers or villager tokens in exchange for emeralds. Recyclers only accept markers and tokens from the village they were created from, putting the option onto the player to either convert their tokens from other villages first, or perform a lengthy expedition to find a recycler at a different village. Not all villagers are wanting to make trades with the village. The Tectopia Thief is one such figure that prefers to benefit itself. When night falls, a thief may plot an attempt to steal materials from a villager's warehouse. To ensure they enact their heist successfully, a thief maintains its distance from villagers. Villagers that spot a thief will sound the alarm, forcing the thief to retreat. However, for the cunning thief that successfully sneaks inside the warehouse, will steal some items and make their escape. Should a thief be killed during their escape, their stolen goods can be recovered and returned to the village. Villages with higher populations increases the likelihood of thieves to steal its supplies. Thieves can be quite easy to detect, but they add another way to add an unexpected encounter when playing with Tectopia. All four of these Tectopia add-ons work in tandem with Tectopia information, ensuring that the player is able to maximize a complete experience with Tectopia and the add-ons. The final two mod add-ons bring some mod compatibility to Tectopia 
with other mods. Tectopia Harvest Craft Compat provides compatibility between Tectopia and one of the big food mods, Pam's Harvest Craft. From this, Tectopia villagers will not only farm Pam's crops, but they can consume foods from Pam's Harvest Craft, letting these villagers feel both satiated and happier for longer. Pairing a Tectopia village with Ice and Fire provides an extra challenge, as its new dangerous creatures can prove to be a real threat. However, the main adversaries, the dragons, ignore Tectopian settlements completely. Fortunately, this is remedied using the dragon's attack Tectopia's add-on, which fixes this bug, ensuring for a more difficult Tectopia experience, should the player desire a tougher Tectopia playthrough. As an optional adjustment to Tectopia, a range of resource pack add-ons can be used to alter the mod's looks. One such resource pack, Vanilla Tectopians, aims to integrate the vanilla villager style into Tectopia's villages. It takes the standard villager robes from vanilla and scatters them across each Tectopia villager accordingly, factoring in their profession to achieve the closest vanilla adaptations. Continuing the theme of vanilla-friendly textures, Tectopia UI Repaint updates the structure markers and villager tokens to resemble the Japa texture style, capturing a glimpse of what Tectopia would visually look like if it was in modern versions. Instead of going for a vanilla look, why not draw back into the past with Tectopia Medieval Age? Villagers are treated to their own clothing fit for medieval times. Meanwhile, structure markers are adorned by wooden plates and worker tokens are displayed on a piece of parchment. Another resource pack, Rustic Tectopia, is also a viable candidate for a medieval grounded look. Each villager profession and gender has their own rustic set of clothing. Structure markers and villager tokens share a consistent paper theme to fit well into a rustic style village. Even the heart and beard textures are given a facelift to follow the looks of the other new textures. Faithful is one of the most iconic resource packs in Minecraft, and for players who are playing with Tectopia, they can have the complete Faithful experience with Tectopia Classic Faithful. Every item and villager is retextured to fit perfectly into the Classic Faithful style, allowing for a seamless playthrough with both Tectopia and Faithful. This sums up the range of Tectopia add-ons available. Whether it's for players who wanted some new opportunities with Tectopia, or to those who desired a different coat of paint, these small add-ons could pose some new ideas to play through Tectopia in a new way.